people that you're a single mum. People will assume that you're just not with the father of your child anymore or with your children's fathers anymore. But when you tell people that the father of your child or the fathers of your children have no involvement with their kids, three things happen. The first thing is that people will wonder what you did to make a man not want to see his kids and not want to know them. The second thing is that they're going to wonder if you are a respectable woman for a man or for multiple men even to disrespect a woman who has their child or their children. The third thing that happens is that straight away people want to know if you are on benefits or if you're working and then from there on you're put into the single mother hierarchy and treated accordingly to your category. Unfortunately, this is how it can be with most people's attitudes towards single mothers in society. Now, if your children's fathers are still in their lives, then you are much likely to be treated with a higher level of respect by people than a single mother who tries to take on both the roles of mother and father would get. Now, I just want to say to you ladies that there is nothing wrong with having to become a single mum mum after the father of your child is gone. If the father is gone, then who else is going to take on all of these responsibilities? It's such a shame that most people never think of it this way and instead just think of bashing single mothers, especially those at the bottom of the hierarchy who have small children and are basically stay-at-home mums on benefits. Now, I know this is very brief, but if you can relate to what I'm saying, let's say, for example, you've ever gone somewhere and you feel out of place because even though you're a single mum with other single mums, you're the only single mum whose child's father doesn't take an interest. Don't make that fact make you feel like you are less than any other single mother out there. Besides, you never know what women who have their children's fathers around have to put up with and go through just to get a weekend off or whatever. Having to put up with girlfriends turning up outside your home or having to deal with your children being let down every other weekend or just any kind of drama. You never know what these other single mothers are going through. So when people say, oh, you're a single mum, mum, as in, oh, you're doing it all by yourself for real, be proud to say yes if that's you because you're doing the best that you can in a situation that you probably never thought in your life that you'd ever find yourself in. So don't allow others to dictate to you by the way they treat you which category of the illusion or single mother hierarchy that you belong in. And just keep pushing forward in your life until you arrive to where you feel that you belong at. Bear that in mind ladies and thanks for watching.